box two box is back with another video varvar what are we doing today today we're playing who wants to be a millionaire i'm playing the role of the host slash banker i have a million virtual dollars to spend and pala million firms can win it by answering these questions that get progressively harder are we ready ready as ever okay let's start it so my first question for you pala is worth one dollar who is Everton's manager? A, Sam Allardyce. B, Harry Redknapp. C, Roy Hodgson. Or D, Sean Dyche. Varvar, before I answer this and hopefully get it one whole dollar, what do the power-ups do? So you, Firms and Millie, all have two power-ups. A 50-50, which I eliminate two of the answers, and phone a friend, which you can call whoever you want and ask them the question. Are you good with that? Great with that. So my answer for this first question worth one whole dollar is D, Sean Dyche. Lock it in? Locked it in. Sean Dyche is correct. Congrats, Pella. You've made one dollar. Do you want to cash out? I do not want to cash out. I'm going to keep the ball rolling. Welcome, Millie. Are you ready for your one dollar question? I'm ready to rock and roll, boss. Hit me with it. Which of the following teams has Jao Cancelo not played for? A, Sevilla. B, Valencia. C, Inter, and D, Juventus. Big man, I'm feeling an A for this one. Lock it in, 100% certain. Locked it in, I'm wearing the Inter kit. I know Joao Cancelo ball. It was A, Millie, congrats, you've made $1. I'm feeling wealthier already. Do you want to pull out or keep going? No. Millie, your pullout game I think is quite God. strong. God, goodness gracious. Firms, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me, Varvar. Are you ready to lay down your ball knowledge? Let's get it. Okay, Firms, question number one. Which of these teams has Inter not beat in this year's Champions League? A, Milan. <laughs> I think we all know the answer to that. B, Porto. C, Benfica. And D, Bayern Munich. This is an easy one, Varvar. You know, I've been watching my Inter ball very frequently. They lost against Bayern twice. You've been watching frequently. Are you a closet Inter fan? I have to hate whenever I can. D. Bayern is the correct answer. Congrats, firm. You've made a whole dollar. Put it in the bank. That doubles your net worth. Oh my God, it does. <laughs> Are you going to pull out or keep going? I might have to keep going with this one. Okay, sounds good. So now we're on to the $10 round. Pala, how are you feeling? I'm feeling all right. You sound very enthusiastic. Here is your $10 question. Who is Manchester United's number 10? A, Marcus Rashford. B, Anthony Martial. C, Bruno Fernandes. And D, Jadon Sancho. Of course, Varvar, you had to sneak in some Manchester United questions. That's my job. That's the only reason I'm here. Unfortunate for you, the banker. I think I know this one for, what is this, $10? 10, 10 whole smackaroonies. For 10 Schmeagles, I'm gonna say A, Rashford. I don't know what currency 10 Schmeagles is. Is it worth more than $10 or less than $10? Beats me. Okay, well, Rashford was the correct answer. Congrats, pal, you've made $10. Now, do you wanna keep it or do you wanna keep moving on? $10, man, you could go get like a uh, pizza or something. I think I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep moving on is what I'm gonna do. Let's go, Pala. Let's go. Millie, here is your $10 question. 10 is definitely bigger than one. I'm ready to make some money, big man. Let's get it. Which of these Italian players were not eligible to play for Brazil? A, Jorginho. B, Thiago Mota. C, Emerson Palmieri. And D, Ferrati. That's gonna be a trick question. Not eligible. Not eligible to play for Brazil. My gut's telling me D, I will stick with D. Millie, Verratti is the correct answer. You have made $10. I know my Italo ball. You can now officially spend more than Inter will in this future transfer window. I'm gonna make sure to give that $10 and leave it at the door, big man. Let's get it, Millie. Firms, we can up your career earnings from $1 to 10 by answering this simple question. We need that. So Firms, here's your $10 question. Which of these countries has only hosted the World Cup once? 
A, Italy, B, Brazil, C, Germany, and D, the United States of America. There's only one country here that rings the bell right away, and that's the States. I will go for D. D firms was the correct answer. Congrats. 10 whole dollars firms. You could go buy a, a trio somewhere. Another Charles de Catelere at the door. No, that's 35 mil there, firms. Oh, wasted. You, you can't even pay for that, even if you went the whole way today. You're right. I need that million. Pala, I think this is going to be the easiest $100 you've ever made in your life. I don't know. You follow me on TikTok? I do. That's why I know you're a Juventus fan. So your $100 question is, who is Juventus' top goal scorer in Serie A this season? A, Rabiot. B, Vlaovic. C, Milik, and D, Di Maria. See, I thought I knew, but now that the pressure's on and I can't get this wrong, now it's a different situation. What's your, what's your thought process going into it, man? I knew at one point during the season that Rabiot was tied with Vlaovic on total goals. I believe you are correct. I'm not 100% certain, but I do believe so. Di Maria, I think he scored maybe like max three goals. Like, not definitely not more in Serie A. Uh, and who's the other stinker? Milik? Yeah, it was Milik. Yeah, Milik scored some goals. So it's between Milik and Vlaovic. I'm gonna go with Vlaho Poop. Was it A? It was It was B, Vlaovic. B. Pala. Aw, aw. That was the correct answer. Of course it was. 100 whole dollars. You know what I can get with 100 dollars these days? Are you gonna take the 100 and go buy whatever you want? Or are you gonna keep playing? I'm going to keep playing. I think I'm going to keep playing. Okay, so we'll see you in the next round. See you. Millie, you've made it to this point. It's been a long way, but it will be even longer. So give me that question, big man. You're not even halfway to the million dollars yet. All roads lead to that million. I'm ready to go. So Millie, here's your $100 question. Hit me with it, big man. Who is Brazil's captain? A. Marquinhos. B. Militao. C, Casemiro, and D, Halison. I love you. Ooh, no Neymar in this list. No Neymar, you're right. I did not put Neymar. I didn't want to trip him up too bad. At a $100 question, trying to trip me up, the cards are stacked against me. You I know still, it's rigged you, still have your, you have your power-ups, huh? Uh, on a $100 question? Uh, not being used, big man. If you need them, you need them. I'm going to go with C, Casemiro. The new Brazil captain is Casemiro. $100 in your bank account, Millie. Manchester United legend bringing me home the bacon. Let's go, fellas. Are you going to cash in or are you going to keep going? We're going to keep going, big man. I don't think we're going to see a lot of cash-ins today. We shall see. I might be making a $100 donation to Firms' bank account. I love it. Here is your $100 question. Who is the only goalie to win a Ballon d'Or? A. Yashin. B, Schmeichel, C, Van der Sar, and D, Oliver Kahn. Obviously, there's only one guy to have won it. And all these guys' primes were before we were even born. So yeah. you need that good ball knowledge firms. But you know what? Have you ever seen those comps of Yashin back in the day? Yeah, it kind of looked like David De Gea now. Oh, yeah, it did. So that's going to be my answer. I'm going to lock it in. Lev Yashin. Was the correct answer for him? You have made a hundred dollars. I need that. Give me those a hundred dollars. Put you're, it in the bank. You're cashing. You're putting. You're putting it in the bank. You're cashing out. No, I mean I'm putting it in the bank, but I'm continuing. Okay, sounds good. You will keep going. A thousand dollar question round right now. Let's go. One thousand dollars. Someone's life will be changed right now. I'm feeling good. I don't know how the others are doing, but I still got my 50-50. My phone, a friend. Feeling good. So, Pala, $1,000, here's your question. Which of these players were never signed by Chelsea? A, Fabio Borini, Milan legend. B, Quaresma. C, Tariq Lamptey. And D, Adamola Lookman. I know Quaresma played. Well, I don't know if he played, but he was signed. I know Borini. I know... Borini, we, we actually used him in a guess who on TikTok. And I'm between C and D. Oh no, it was actually Common Clubs. I don't know if the real OGs remember that. The Common Clubs of Fabio Bodini. I think I'm going to go with D, the Atalanta legend in the making, Lookman. 
Adamola Lookman is correct. He was never signed by Chelsea. Who was he signed by, though? I remember him at Leicester. Okay. And I don't remember other than that. That's why you're in that chair and the big boys are in this chair. Millie, we move on to the next round. It's starting to get a serious. I'm actually sweating a little bit, big man. I'm ready to rock and roll. I feel the dampness from over here. Okay, come on now. Come on now. <laughs> I put Mill the order in on. I'm good to go. <laughs> Millie, here is your question. Which of these players has never played for Ajax? A, Milik. B, Alderweireld. C, Barcelona legend Boyan. And D, Denzel Dumfries. Ooh. You have to know your Eredivisie ball for this one, Millie. I think my inter ball knowledge is helping me out here, big man. I'm not confirming or denying. You still have your power-ups, huh? 50-50, phone a friend? I don't think I'll need them, though, because Dumfries played for PSV. He didn't play for Ajax. So uh, I'm going to pick Denzel. Denzel Wash... I mean, Denzel Dumfries is the correct answer, Millie. You've won $1,000. The only time Dumfries has helped me. Thank goodness. Thank the Lord. Firms, big boy numbers now. Big boy. I better hear some Milan questions because uh, I didn't get any so far, so. Well, you're getting quite the opposite, Firms, because here is your question. Who is the youngest player in Premier League history? A, Ethan Nwanueri, B, Harvey Elliott, C, Jack Wilshere, and D, the best left back of all time, Luke Shaw. They definitely all started at a very young age. I remember Luke Shaw at Southampton. You could correct me if I'm wrong. Team of the season under Mauricio Pochettino. Oh yeah, it's true. Streets won't forget. I will not forget that performance. I think Millie definitely forgets that, but whatever. Um, Harvey Elliott, not really. I'm gonna pass him. Jack Wilshere, Arsenal legend. But man of the, Jack Wilshere, we must mention, man of the match against Barcelona in the Champions League. Another great performance that you're mentioning. But I'll stick to A. A is correct, Firms. He's actually looking to move this year, maybe to Chelsea, cross town. That's crazy. Already? Already, 15, Lari leaving Arsenal. He knows, he knows Arsenal don't got that aura. Good for him, he's a baller. Life changing money. $10,000. A new car is on the line now, Pala. Let's get it. I'm ready for my 10,000 schmeckles. Everyone's still got their power-ups, which is crazy. That is crazy. <laughs> so, Pala, here is your question. Which goalkeeper has had the most clean sheets in the 21st century? Is it A, Casillas, B, Buffon, C, Manuel Neuer, or D, Peter Cech? I heard goalies and I just had to take a quick breather because... No respect for the hardest position to play on the field. Some would say it is the hardest position, but I'm thinking Casillas is the obvious answer. But Buffon is also close. Why would it be 10,000 if the obvious answer was Casillas? Peter Cech, he wears a helmet. Like, respect to him for whatever he's been doing, but he wears a helmet. Head protection is not a joke, pal. I don't know why you're laughing. That is true. Protection is very important, Varvar. Neuer, however, played in the Bundesliga. Those seven, six score lines, you're not catching me, Neuer. I'm, I'm not saying anything. I think I'm going to take the 50-50. 50-50? Yeah. First power-up used. Wow. So, Pala, your 50-50 is between Casillas and Manuel Neuer. Thank you, host Varva, for basically giving me the answer. I'm going to go with A, Casillas. Pala, the correct answer was actually Ma Casillas! I didn't bite. Okay, well, you win $10,000. Congrats, Pala. We'll move on to Millie. What if I want to pull out? Do you want to pull out? Is that not an option for me? It's an option. I mean, it would... It, it... I like this guy. He knows I'm going to stay rolling with it. I knew. I didn't forget. I knew. Millie. $10,000, life-changing money right now. Got myself a nice three-piece. I'm ready for this big question, big man. The big question is, who leads Barcelona in assists this season in La Liga? Is it A, Lewandowski, B, Pedri, C, Usman Dembele, or D, Rafinha? Vava, that's a stinky question. Millie, you should know this. You actually beat them in the Champions League. 
I'm very proud that we beat them in the Champions League. Now we're in the final and Barca are nowhere to be found. The Europa League run in the Champions League, Millie. Congrats, you've made the final. <laughs> you know what? I'm looking at these, these picks and I'm going to have to do a 50-50, big man. You're starting to get a little tricky, these questions. You're copying Paolo. I, listen, I don't think Paolo is getting questions like this, big man. So, Millie, here's your 50-50. Your choices are Rafinha and Pedri. So B for Pedri and D for Rafinha. Rafinha is the more attacking player. Pedri is more integral to the whole system. But I don't. Pedri doesn't got the juice like that. I think I think Rafinha is the one getting the assist here. Milly, can you take a guess as to who it was? Please tell me it wasn't Pedri. Millie, it was Rafinha. Congrats, ten thousand dollars. Let's go. That three piece is gonna look nice and good on me, big man. You can now afford one thirtieth of Romelu Lukaku for a week, Millie. Oh man, he's gonna get me one thirtieth of a goal. Then I'm ready to rock and roll. But Millie, first we need to decide: Are you pulling out and cashing out, getting that Romelu Lukaku, or or staying? I think I'm gonna go next round with my nice three piece Brioni soup, big man. Brioni. Always. Maybe lower piano. Depends how I'm feeling. He's bougie like that. Always. Firms, another round, another question. For 10,000. Your $10,000 question is, how many assists does Mario Balotelli have in his Premier League career? A, 1, B, 8, C, 10, and D, 15 whole assists. Firms, what are we thinking? So here's my thought process. The only assist that I remember from Balotelli is the one to Aguero. To what do you mean? He, he was dishing out dimes like Mesut Ozil. He definitely was not, but I'm not sure about it. So I'll call my good friend, Jack. Um, Let's get him on the line. We'll uh, get Jack get on the line right now. Yo, what's up, Firms? Jack, I need a big favor from you. I'm listening, what, what do you need? So, Mario Balotelli, how many assists does he have in the Premier League? Is it 1, 8, 10, or 15? You said, you said Mario Balotelli, right? Yeah, Mario Balotelli. You know this, Jack. I know you do. Frims, Frims, I know this. The question is, do you know this? Obviously, it's 1. Okay, no. yeah. I felt you know it was 1. Right? You, know that, you know that goal, too. It's, you it's, know the it's the Aguero. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I'm, yeah. I'll stick to my answer, Varvar. We're keeping Jack on the phone for the reveal. Let's let's keep him. The answer yeah, was one. Congrats, Firms, you got it. Congrats to Jack too. Yeah, let's go, Firms. Let's go. So, Firms, you're now up to ten thousand dollars. That's a lot of money. Let's get it. Next round, let's go. It's all come down to this: one hundred thousand dollars. We're playing with houses now. Houses? Houses, full on houses. Wait, where are we getting these houses in Texas? Anywhere other than any major metropolitan city. You're, you're buying a small little house. I don't know what that means. Let's get the question. Your question for $100,000 is, which of these players has won a Golden Boy Award? Is it A, Aguero, B, Coutinho, C, Deli Alli, or D, Marcus Rashford? Hmm, golden boy. I have not brushed up on my golden boy knowledge in a minute. In a minute, I'll be honest. This is for 100K. This is for 100K. Is it worth phoning a friend? Because I think I might need it for the finals. I don't know. I, I think it would be. What, what's your, who do you think it could be? Who do I think it could be? Yeah. I think it could be Aguero. I think it could be Aguero. That's the only thing I got in mind. I'm going to go with whatever letter Aguero is. Aguero is correct, Palov. You've won $100,000. Now, this is the tough question. Do I keep the 100000 or do I go for the million? I personally, Paolo, I take the money and stash it in the bank account. Let that, that, with interest, that goes up year by year. You know how long it would take me to turn 100 k into $1 million in a bank account? I say you all in it, actually. I would have to phone a friend and ask my banker friend about that one. Yeah. <laughs> but... <sighs> Government bonds. You guys don't even want to hear about it. Let's get to the next question. You're going. Yeah, I think I'm going to go. I'm going to risk it all. Millie, $100,000. How are we feeling? The three pieces on. Maybe a nice AP will do the trick with that 100 grand, big man. That's a gorgeous watch. We live in lavishly here. Hopefully, I can give you that 
with this $100,000 question. Help me out here, big man, please. So, so Millie, how many goals did Iniesta score for Barcelona in La Liga? Is it A, 35, B, 50, C, 75, and D, 90? What are we thinking? Oh my goodness. I, this AP is going to come tough because I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this one, big man. I'm not going to lie. Before researching this, I did not know this. Like, the, the thing is with Iniesta, it's tricky. You could say it's 90, you could say 35. Anything in between, it, it's, it's close. It's because for me, Iniesta wasn't the type of player to get 90 goals. Like, he was very attacking, he was a very effective player, but I just don't see him scoring 90. Even 75, I find, is like a very high number for him. I'll give you a trick. You have to say, I think he scored this amount of goals per season on average yeah. for this amount of seasons. I'm gonna go with... I'm gonna go with B, 50. Please tell me that I got Millie, the AP already fitted, Millie, big man. Millie, your AP is not coming. No. B was the wrong answer. A is the right answer. 35 was the right answer, Millie. Oh my God. Uh, AP's gonna have to wait, big man. I got the three piece though. You got, no. No, I actually lost the three piece. Yeah, you lost the three piece too. <laughs> You're going home empty handed. Millie is officially eliminated. I'm gonna stick with the inter kid, I guess. I hope the boys get a better luck than me because this is rough. Firms, this might be the biggest question of your life so far. It definitely is, 100,000, that's a lot of money, my friend. It is a lot of money, so here's your chance to win it. Which of these players is sponsored by Adidas? Oh my. A, Sadio Mane, B, Erling Haaland, and C, Hyung Min Son, and D, Rooney. Okay, right off the bat, I'm kicking out Rooney. The Nike commercial is iconic. I'm not saying anything. You don't need to say anything. Um, who else is there? Mane? He's, he's Puma, I believe. So I'm not... Oof. I'll keep Mane. Who, uh, Haaland, definitely Nike. Um, Nike, we turned European. Yeah, that's how we say it down in Europe. Sun? Sun is a good guess. I mean, it's either between him or Mane. But I remember seeing Sun wearing the Adidas a lot, so I'll stick with Sun. Firms. No. Youngman's Sun was correct. You've won $100,000. Oh, let's go. Are you going to keep playing? Of course. You're going to... I didn't even say the cash out option. It's not even a... It's, I don't need to. Oh my God. Okay, I'm we're going to keep for playing. The milli. You're going for the milli. Yep. One whole million dollars. It all comes down to this last question. Are you ready? I can't lie, I'm a little bit nervous. You are a bit nervous. I can tell. I, I smell you from here, Paula. Yeah, my bad. I didn't put the order in today. <laughs> okay, so one million dollar question, Paula. Final question. Which of these players was not in the 2006 Ballon d'Or top three ranking? Is it A, Buffon, B, Cannavaro, C, Henri, or D, Ronaldinho? Oh, that's a tough one. That is a tough one. I still have my phone a friend, right? You still have your phone a friend. I have a Ballon d'Or 2006 specialist actually on the phone. Yeah? Yeah, I'm just gonna give him a call. I, I didn't even know those existed. Yeah, 2006, I have four, five, and six. Oh, okay, <laughs> I don't know. 07, they start getting like a bit <laughs> more scared. Hard to find. <laughs> so I'm gonna give him a call now. Let's go. Yeah, power. Mike, how are you? Not too bad, you? I'm pretty good. I have the chance here to win one million dollars. We can go on a vacation, we can buy a car, we can do whatever we want. Okay, talk to me. So, I, I, I just told everybody that you're the 2006 Ballon d'Or Specialist. Now, I'm not too sure about that, but I have a question for you. Ready for it? I'm ready. So we're talking about the 2006 Ballon d'Or nominees, and I'm trying to find which one wasn't a nominee, okay? And the options that I'm gonna give you are Pele, Maradona, Luca Toni, and El Sharawi. <laughs> El Sharawi. <laughs> wow, he has high ball knowledge. <laughs> By the way, this is the specialist I was telling you about. Mike, honestly, I just called you to let you know that I think I'm winning a million dollars here. What, what's Let's the answer? Because I think the answer is D. It is D. It is Ronaldinho Pala. You win a million dollars. Let's go. Mikey, where are we going? Let's go to Greece and Spain, brother. Oh, you know I'm there. Let's go.
So Pala, you have now officially won a million dollars. What are you going to do with it? First, I'm going to go to Greece and Spain with my expert over here. 2006 Ballon d'Or <laughs> expert El Sharawi. And then maybe I'll buy a, a Juve shirt because <laughs> the stocks are low right now. Okay, sounds good. Pala, you are now officially a millionaire. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe I was previously. <laughs> okay, sorry, pal. I was not. A, I, I was not familiar with your game. I won a few challenges before this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, exactly. Thanks, guys. Firms, I'm already down one million dollars. Please do not do it to me again. You're already down. Who? Won? I'm, I'm, you're gonna have to wait for the episode to come out, big oh man. My God. One million dollar question, firms. It all comes down to this. I'm ready for this. I hope your Bundesliga knowledge is up to par. Who has the most assists in the Bundesliga this season? Is it A, Rafael Guerrero, B, Randall Kolomuani, narrow it down legend, C, Muziala, and D, Diaby. Firms, what's the verdict? All that remains is one power up, 50-50. I'm definitely gonna use it. I'm not allowing this. He's making, he wants me to go broke. I definitely do. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave you with Rafael Guerrero and Muziala, A and C. Oh, Musella has been having an excellent season and so has Guerrero. I'm not giving any hints. I've, I've dished out enough money today. I'm not giving out hints. There's no hints needed, but I, I need to think about this. Musiala. Just so you know, one of your good friends, Millie, actually left with zero dollars in his pocket. Oh yeah, so Pala won? Yeah, oh. I, obviously the Inter fans looking at free stuff. It's not. Look the... at this. Look at the coincidence, man. The Milan fan in the final and the Inter fan is uh, chilling at home <laughs> with no money. <laughs> I think though, I'm pretty confident to be honest. Guerrero has been having a very excellent season. Listen, he, he dishes out some assists. He crosses good too. <laughs> I'm gonna stick with him. Okay, firms, are you are you locking that in? Ooh, I think so. Yeah, you're, you're, I'll lock it in. You're locking Guerrero in. Listen, I have to. Firms, oh, one million dollars is going straight to your bank account. You've won one million dollars. Vamos! I'm really down two million dollars right now. Why am I getting excited for him? I, I could split it with you. 500k each. Firms, you know how many V-Bucks you could buy with that? V-Bucks. Fortnite we're talking about? Fortnite. Oh my god. I'm gonna pass on that, but... We're looking at two new millionaires, Pala and Firms. Let's go. And I'm officially in debt for the rest of my life. And Millie too. So now that I'm officially down two million dollars and Firms wins a million, Pala wins a million, and Millie wins zero. He comes out as good as me. But uh, anyways, guys, thank you for watching the whole video. And uh, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Paul and Millie looking like bodyguards out here. Ti amo. Get me my Brioni suit firms, please. Forza Milan. Oh, you want to? Forza Milan.